talk about the uh, the new generation of Counter Strike, and so many of those names have done damage here in Berlin, 2019. So we've got an outside smoke coming in here, Alex. That's thrown by Gade, I believe, and it's towards Connector. They're going to throw that lower ramp as well, try and keep players out towards the A bomb site. Golden's getting plenty of chances. Yeah, eight HP. How is he still alive here? Finally, as he takes him down, gets a double. And that pretty much is the round, ladies and gents, because Get Right and Lecro are in a five versus two. They know where Lecro is. Get Right gets a bullet to the face. AZ will take care of him. And there it is. They really needed a flying start here on trains. We even stand the chance, if you ask me. Um, but they get anything but. Three kills for AZ. 35 seconds. And I do want to keep my eye on Kirby's position because he's right again, found a gap. <laughs> Look at this. From behind, he strikes, catches Golden with his pants around his ankles. Lecro's got to react, but he's got, he can't turn his back for long. Oh, the timing's brutal. Kirby sneaking from Ivy when CT attention was drawn, and just like that, the round completely disintegrates in front of NIP. Get right, AWP. Nothing he can really do but save it at this point, I'm afraid. He'll be holding towards the Ivy position. It's a nice shot. We'll take AZ down. Throws himself back in towards the rifle. Not known to be an AWP up. Looking to stay alive here. Self-preservation is the aim of the game. That's good for two. He was going to be hunted regardless. I think at that point they were gunning for mercenary. Not expected to, to be honest. Like he's just filling in. Because he could. I mean, if you think about it, the list is relatively short unless they want to take a gamble. This is unknown territory for them. Can't have participated in the minor circuit. Which is why we don't see Plopsky here. So back towards a site that has had a mixed bag of success. It does look like they're considering just as the smoke clears, just charging down. That's a big peak in Lecro. He is going to have an opportunity to fight back, but no, does not land. Golden, on the other hand, has successfully found two. Nice work from him as Valder will shut him off. Yugi can lock down Z now. He knows that's his responsibility. The savior here in round 17. Let's find out. But now he enters towards the ivy side of things, and that's the rifle gone. Kirby catching him and towards the train. Necro will scoop that one up, though. Unfortunately, no armor. He could get caught out and just tapping away. Doesn't connect. Kirby finding himself another one. Get right makes his presence known with a flashbang. Gate. Ooh, look. Could, could have got caught out guard, off guard, and actually, so will Get right as AZ leaps down Pop Dog. Kirby finds himself his triple, and he's on for quite the miraculous KD for the wrap this one up. Farming his stats 19 to 4. Well, they'll buy up now, but two players were pretty much fully invested last round. That'll be Lecro and Forrest, so they'll be on Deagles. Time, these young guns coming up. Will NIP be able to get through another another? It's a great question. I mean, looking at the teams that I've seen already that aren't here, you know, a name at the tip of my tongue, just because I, I really enjoyed that dust too, is Fours. Fours, their T side was, was dynamic. It was inspired. They had some incredible individual plays. Big names. Makes a power impress me as well. And so it will be NIP looking to find their fifth, the last round of our first half in our second map of our last series on the secondary stream. Valder's coming behind them all. Oh dear. Backs turn, pants around their ankles, and Gay's going to do exactly oh, the same. It's, don't like that. Yeah, the sound effects from Henry summarize it perfectly.